there are some strategies you have to use and if you use this strategy you will achieve mastery on this filleting part so there are three aspects how you can improve your filleting by using any software so the first thing what you have to ensure that is you can note down add tangency how to improve filleting add tangency so what is that now i want to give you one example here consider this is one rectangular fringe right imagine there is no radius here imagine this is a sharp corner okay all are sharp corners now if i provide or if i select this edge for filleting you must have observed that fillet will start from this end to this end that that means only this patch will be filleted okay so initially what you have to do give all corner fillets first so when you start filleting select this edge second third and fourth okay now here one more step is that i am not i am not considering this step so provide four corners and now when you select this edge for filleting the total chain is selected do this and this will improve your filleting skill so that is first thing add tangency second you can note down that is a pipe theory so what is that pipe theory bigger pipe and smaller pipe so smaller pipe can be fitted in the bigger pipe right same you have to use in your cad modeling here you can see there are so many different fillets are provided in this region imagine this fillet is say r10 this fillet is say r3 and here one fillet is there say r2 so r10 r3 and r2 that is a combination so what you have to do here start with bigger fillet so no down bigger fillet first that is r10 then you have to go for medium fillet that is r3 and then you have to select the smallest fillet that is r2 this is called as a pipe theory so if you apply this your filleting speed will be tremendous and you will not have this problem why i am telling you this imagine you have to create a 3d model of this component and suppose 10 hours are required to make this model another important question similar drawing or component will be shown to you during interview and you will be asked tell me how many hours are required to make this model so you have to practice this so imagine 10 hours are required so first 4 hours you can create all features and last 6 hours you are just providing fillets and draft angle now third strategy what you have to use you can note down change the sequence change the sequence means what all about two methods you have applied you are not getting results so what you have to do suppose this radius you are not able to provide so what you have to do just delete this fillet nearby fillet provide this fillet first and then this fillet getting my point so change the sequence is the third strategy now draft angle next important is draft angle what is draft angle see here is one line which is called as a parting line and all 90 degree faces to this parting plane you have to provide draft angle draft angle is required for smooth ejection of component from the die or mold so that's why draft is required now when you are creating this draft angle or providing this draft angle suppose this dimension is 15 mm for example you have to consider 15 mm at the bottom and you have to increase the material on the parting plane so that's why it is called as a draft allowance so draft allowance means you are adding material on the component there are two types of drawings in the company one is called as a component drawing and another is called as a process drawing like maybe forging drawing or casting drawing product drawing means that drawing the product is fully finished condition 
ready for fitment on the vehicle for example that drawing is called as a product drawing okay so product drawing contains all machining areas threading part holes everything and when this drawing is released ma department or p department when they are adding this allowances on the component drawing like machining allowance or draft allowance that drawing is called as a forging drawing or casting drawing or a process drawing so when you receive any drawing just confirm which is that drawing whether it's a component drawing or process drawing if process drawing is there then already draft angles are provided you don't have to do anything but when you receive component drawing all these allowances you have to provide so when you are providing draft allowance you have to increase the material on the component 